Uh, this is one of those machines that the Nazis manufacture to get rid of the evidence of the Holocaust. The Holocaust co caused by the Einsatzgruppen, the mobile killing squads of Himmler that travel behind the front, the, the, uh, behind the Wehrmacht as they were conquering the East. They would come in behind them, they would, they would loot and they would go straight to the population and murder all the Jews and all the undesirable people for the Nazis. This, uh, after, uh, this kind of machines was used right after the, the turn of events when the war turned against the Nazis and they realized that they were going to get caught. So, fearing the consequences, Himmler sent some of his cronies to come back on their steps, to get back on their steps and come back and unearth all the bodies they spread all over the east uh, from the um, mass graves over in the Baltic countries, over in Poland and in Ukraine and all over in Russia, etc. And using this kind of machines and the slave labor, of course, they disinter all the bodies, burn them, and then the bones were uh, destroyed by these machines and used for agricultural purposes. And of course, it was too late. It was not, I mean, everybody knew about it. So it was just double work because they knew what happened. This was also used when they closed the Reinhardt action camps of uh, Treblinka, Zobibor, Belgiek, and uh, the other one, um, after they closed them, they, uh, they, they disinter all the bodies, they destroy them with these uh, machines and fire, and then they raise the camps to the ground and planted tree, trees and forests in, in place. Being Germans, they had a lot of order, so if you go and visit those forests nowadays, you would see that all the trees are lined up perfectly and they're not made by nature, but by men. So this is one of those machines. Uh, they, they, would, they, you know, they would distribute the grinding bones to different uh, farmers and, and agencies and places in those sacks marked with their swastikas. There's the motor and there's the mechanism used to destroy the, the bones. There it is. And then they would shoot up the, the dust, the particles down this way and down to the chute right there where they would fill up the, the sacks with the product. So yeah, we can uh, we know that this machine was used for that purpose, and we know for certain this is broken. Pretty sad. We know that thousands of people's remains passed through this machine.